Hello. 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 Hi. Welcome. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Hello, ladies. Gentlemen, how are you? How are you tonight? Good? Good? Really good? Good, really. <laughs> really good. Amazingly. I'm happy to see you connected. I'm very happy to see you. Okay. Feedback from last session. Feedback from last session. What do you remember? What do you remember? What do you remember? Yeah. Huh? Oh, huh? Yes? Um, Questions I, with? I don't know. Hello. <laughs> with, with us. Correct. Questions with do and does. For example, give me a question. Give me a question. For example. Do huh? you have a sister? Yes, I do. I have a sister. Her name is her name is Clarita. People people call her Clary. And you? Do you have a sister or brother? Yes. Yes, uh, I. Yes, I. Sister. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Questions with us. Questions with us. Does your house have a garage? Um, yes, yes, I do. Sería siempre o yes, I do. Uh-uh. ¿Qué sería? ¿Cuál sería el subject ahí? Kimberly, estamos hablando de qué estamos hablando. O de, de quién. De qué um, o de quién. Does your house. Es un objeto. Ah, bingo. What is the subject? I? It. 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 Does your house have a garage? Yes, yes, it, yes, it do. Yes, it do. Are you sure? ¿Con quién usamos, con quién usamos does? ¿Con quién usamos do? Yes, it do or yes, it does? Uh, yes, yes, it does. does. Yes, it does. Ah, it does. bingo. Remember, he, she, it, does. All right. Do you speak Spanish? Yes, I do. Yes, yes I, I do. do. Y ahí podemos dar como que más eh, detallito, ¿verdad? Podemos usar las palabras a little. Repeat, a little. A little. A little. A little. Repeat, a lot. Oh, I'm sorry. Repeat, very well. Very well. For example, do you speak uh, do you speak English? <laughs> Hello? Do you speak English? Yes, I do. I do. A little. Yes. Do you speak Spanish? Yes. Yes, I, I do. I do. Yes. Very well. Very well. All right. Do you speak Chinese? No, I don't. No, no, I don't. I don't. No, I don't. Very well. Uh, questions with. Yeah. Let me see. Oh, vamos ahora sí al attendance. Let's go to the attendance. Okay, Abigail, Noemi, Martinez, uh, Martinez. Abner y Tiel Cano Silvestre. Ana Gabriela Coreas Martínez. I am here, teacher. Thanks. Azucena Beralice Bela Muñoz. Brian Edwin Flores Contreras. Daisy Magdalena Hernández Hernández. Here I am, teacher. Thank you so much, lady. Edgardo Antonio Fajardo Polanco. 
Elena Gabriela. Oh, thank you. Elena Gabriela Jovel Valle. Present teacher. Thanks. Eddie Mauricio Martinez Cabrera. Gladys Elizabeth Justiniano Duran. Present teacher. Helen Idalia Ramos de Escalante. Iris Elena Ventura Martinez. Here, teacher. All right. Jessica Maria Los Montes Gomez. Joana Abigail Flores Díaz. Jose Fernando Hernández García. Juan Rafael Esquina. Okay, Juan Rafael Esquina Aguilar. Katie Abigail Montano Rivas. Present. Okay. Kimberly Janet Fuentes de Rivera. Nelson Rolando Melgar. Teacher, here I am. All right, Teacher, sir. Teacher, I am present. Kimberly. You're there? Kimberly Janet. I'm sorry, Kimberly. No worries. I got you here. Oscar Alberto Aguila Romero. Rebecca Eunice Hernandez Rodas. Present. Rosemary Beatriz Ramirez Someta. I'm here, teacher. Oh, you made it early the, today, Miss Someta. And then Sofia Elizabeth Perez Ruiz. Veronica Lisette Marroquín de Santos. I am Vilma, here, teacher. Thank you, Veronica. Vilma Heidi Cortez Beltrán. Here I am, teacher. Thank you, Wendy Abigail Rivera de Escamilla. I'm here. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. All right, ladies, gentlemen, let's go ahead and move on on the platform. Today we're going to learn about furniture. Repeat furniture. 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 Furniture is all the uh, things, all the objects in our house, right? So let's go over this vocabulary. Repeat after me, please. Repeat after me. Armchairs. All right, let's repeat stop. 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 Repeat curtains. 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 Okay. Repeat pictures. 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 Okay, one second, please. One second. And repeat. Okay. Repeat pictures. 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 Give me one second, guys. Give me one second. Repeat. Watch the dog. Watch the dog. <laughs> one second, please. Internet is working very slow. Let me refresh my my screen now. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> okay, so this includes this includes every single thing in our house, right? For example, pictures. Repeat pictures. 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 Clock. 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 Remember that clock, clock is on the wall. Is the one on the wall. Clock. The one on the hand. What's the name of the one on the hand? What? Watch. That's watch. The one here, watch. The one on the wall, it's clock. Repeat bed. Repeat bed. 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 Okay. Repeat table. 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 Okay. Repeat 
microwave oven. Microwave oven. Oven. Microwave oven. Repeat. Refrigerators. Refrigerator. Refrigerator. Lamps. Lamps. Desk. Television. 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 Sofa. 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 Rug. 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 Meter. 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 Chairs. 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 Dresser. 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 Bookcase. Bookcase. Coffee table. Coffee table. Very good, guys. Very good. Do you have any question on this vocabulary? Yes, teacher. Yes. It's mirror or meter. 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 Okay. Meter. Y ponen ahí meter. la posición de la boquita para la R, right? Meter. Meter. Yeah. También siento que hay problemas en refrigerator. 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 Also in microwave oven. Microwave oven. 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 Okay, acuérdense que armchairs, armchairs, donde ponemos los brazos, ¿verdad? El sofá de una persona es diferente a chairs. Right? It's different. Different. Y el que es de tres personas o hasta cuatro, that's the sofa. Okay, let's watch the video. Hi everyone, in this class you'll learn vocabulary for furniture and other household items. Let's get started by listening and repeating the vocabulary. Armchairs Stove Curtains Pictures Clock Bed Table Coffee table Microwave oven, refrigerator, lamps, sofa, desk, bookcase, dresser, chairs, mirror, rug, television. Other vocabulary that is important to understand is kitchen. Dining room, living room, bedroom. And now let's practice using the vocabulary that we just heard by making statements about your kitchen, dining room, living room, and bedroom. For example, my living room has a sofa, a rug, and uh, television. My dining room has. After you complete this exercise, please share your work in our discussion forums. Teacher, no se ve nada. What happened? ¿Qué pasó? ¿No vieron el video? No, no se ve nada. Si no se ve solo en green, se ve todo esto. Ay, qué lástima. Bueno, entonces espero que lo puedan ver ustedes en su plataforma, ¿verdad? Y vamos a hacer como una description ahí, ¿verdad? De lo que tenemos en nuestro uh, comedor. How do you say comedor in English? Dining room. 
dining room. room. Dining room. Dining room. Dining room. Dining room. Dining. 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 Dining room. Yes, es el comedor. Entonces Dining. vamos a decir. Okay. Thank you, guys. My dining room. My dining room. My dining room has. Y comenzamos a describir, verdad? Furniture. My dining room has a table, right? In um, six chairs, yeah. right? What else? My living room, my living room, sala. My living, my living room, room has a sofa. Perfect, perfect. My living room has a sofa. Okay, so you pretty much need to give examples of the furniture that you have. Uh, dormitorio, how do you say dormitorio? Bedroom. Okay, my bedroom. My bedroom has. Can you tell me? Can you tell me what does what does your bedroom have? What does your bedroom have? My bedroom has a television. Creo que no salió ahí ventilador, ¿verdad? Mm, no. Fan. Así como como fan de aficionado, ¿verdad? Fan. My my bedroom has a small bed. Uh, I have a television. Okay. And let me see. A dresser. I have a dresser there. Okay. In my bedroom. <laughs> let me see. Oh, yeah. There is a rug. Una alfombra. There is, there is a rug. Okay. Oh, podemos decir my bedroom has. Y solo comenzamos a dar la lista, ¿verdad? Right? Item after item. Can you tell me what does your bedroom have? My bedroom has, has a lamp. Lamps? Lamps. Lamp. Okay. Does your bedroom have uh, pictures? No. No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. Okay. Uh, what about you guys? What about you? What does your bedroom have? Tell me, tell me, tell me. My bedroom has... Uh, my closet, my desk, my laptop, um, my bed, um, a lamp, a mini board, uh, okay. a calendar. Um, Does it have a mirror? Yes, I I have a mirror, a mirror in a fan. In a fan. Oh, nice, nice, very nice, very informative, very informative. Let's go to the living room. Let's go to the living room. Come on, let's go to the living room. <laughs> what does your living room have? What does your living room have? Uh huh. Volunteers. ¿Cómo se dice equipo de sonido? Stereo. 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 Wow. My living room has a sofa, two armchairs. ¿Cómo se decía la mesita? La mesita. Table. table. Coffee, table. 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 Coffee table. Coffee table. La chiquita, ¿verdad? Coffee okay. table. Um, and a stereo. Uh, and a stereo. Okay. Kitchen, kitchen, kitchen. What do you have in your kitchen? Uh huh. Tell me, what do you have in your kitchen? My kitchen. Uh huh. Let's go. My kitchen has. Give me examples. Refrigerator. Refrigerator. Excellent. Refrigerator. Es que también le puedes decir fridge, ¿verdad? Pero como aquí les enseñamos lo más difícil. 
<laughs> refrigerator or fridge. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. My kitchen has. Come on. My kitchen uh -huh. has. Has a table. Okay. Uh, has a window. Okay. Has a. Ay, ¿cómo se dice chinero? <laughs> chinero. Ah, how do you say chinero, well, guys? No, no. <laughs> uh huh. Nobody. These are these are a um, dressing. Um, these are like all the equipment, all the parts, all the objects that you have in your in your house. Okay. You can say, let me see, cupboard. You can say cupboard, I think. If not, we can check for a different term. Okay. Cupboard. Microwave oven. Microwave oven. Haha, -ha, you're listening to the pronunciation. That's good. Okay, so you have any questions? No questions? How do you say, how do you say librero? Bookcase. 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 How do you say sillas? Chairs. 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 How do you say cocina, pero la que ocupamos, ¿verdad? Para cocinar en sí. No hay lugar, sino. Stuff. Repeat. Stuff. Stop. Stop. How do you Stop. say lamparas? Lamps. 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 Okay, Lamps. good. How do you say alfombra? Rug. 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 How do you say cortinas? Curtains. 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 All right. Wonderful. 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 Let's move on. Let's move on. Let's go to the next topic. Next topic. It will be a statement with there is and there are. Repeat. There is. There is. There is. There is. There is. There are. There are. There are. are. Now remember, there is. Is there for singular. Is. Singular. There are is for plural. Okay, good job, good job, good job. So in that case, let me share, let me share the screen with you once again. Hopefully you can see it. Espero que puedan verla. Pues si no, será en sus propios dispositivos. Okay. Can you see my screen? Yes. Okay. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn how to form statements with there is and there are. Also, how to use some, no, and any when referring to different objects. Let's get started by listening to a conversation titled, There Aren't Any Chairs. This conversation illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Let's listen and practice the conversation. This apartment is great. Thanks. I love it. But I really need some furniture. What do you need? Oh, I need lots of things. There are some chairs in the kitchen, but there isn't a table. And there's no sofa here in the living room. And there aren't any chairs. There's only this lamp. So let's go shopping next weekend. Now, let's learn how to use there is and there are. I would like to start by demonstrating the examples on this chart. There's a bed in the bedroom. There's no sofa in the bedroom. There isn't a table in the kitchen. There are some chairs in the kitchen. There are no chairs in the living room. There aren't any chairs in the living room. <coughs> There's equals there is. All right. Let's just stop right there. Esto es para decir cuando hay existencias, ¿verdad? Estamos hablando de existencias, cuando hay algo, algo o algunos, right? Because singular, 
there is. Repeat, there is. There is. There is. Contraction. There what is the contraction is. of there is? There is. 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 Entonces quiere decir que necesitamos el artículo a o el artículo an, que significan uno o una, solo en este caso. Por ejemplo, there's a bed in the bedroom. Repeat, there's a, there's a bed in the bedroom. A bed. ¿Cuántas camas hay? Una. A bed. It's only one bed, right? Ok, si yo voy a hablar de plural, voy a usar there are. Aquí ya no voy a usar el artículo a or an, aquí ya voy a usar some. Porque ya es plural. Repeat, there are some chairs in the kitchen. 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 Ahora, quiero que piensen en algo que tienen en su casa. Something you have in your bedroom. Vamos a ver, algo que tengan en su bedroom, en su dormitorio. There's a, there's a pillow. Hay una almohada. There's a pillow. There's a teddy bear. There's a fan. Okay, give me examples. There's a. There's a. There's a curtain. There's a curtain. There's a mirror in the There's a mirror in the bedroom. Okay. There is a fan in the bedroom. There's a lamp. There's a fan. Okay. There's a rock in the bedroom. In the bedroom. Adentro, verdad, del dormitorio. There's a. Okay. If it's singular, okay. Now, if it's plural, there are some. There are some, for example, there are some chairs in the kitchen. There are some, there are some, what? In the refrigerator? There are some, what? Apples? Yes, there are some in apples. The... Y lo ponemos plural y pronunciamos todo. La S de ese noun, manzana, manzanas, apples. There are oh. some apples in the refrigerator. There are some oranges. There are some melons. Yes, you got it. If it's plural, pueden decirme uh, un ejemplo plural, a plural example in your house. There are some. Uh -huh. Yes. There are, there are three chairs. Okay, there are four chairs. Chain. There are four chairs. Okay, thank you. What else? There are so many highlighters and pens. Highlighters and pens. There are so many. There are so many. Hay muchos. Wow. Interesting. Thank you. Interesting. Okay, entonces vamos al negative. Negative. Equals there is. To better understand how to form this statement, I would like to write some formulas. For singular objects, there plus chin. Okay, so for the negative, tenemos opciones. En las formas negativas hay dos opciones. Podemos usar la palabra no. For example, there is no. 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 Ojo, no es not. ¿Se acuerdan que hemos visto not? The negation word not. Este es no. Simplemente no. There's no sofa in the bedroom. There is no sofa. So there is zero. There is no there is sofa. No picture in the living room. There is no picture. Sing singular. Singular. There is no picture. There, there is, is no table. 
There is no TV in my bedroom. In, in, in my, my bedroom. bedroom. Yes, bedroom. there is no TV in my bedroom. I need to, I need to buy one, right? Okay, there is no mirror in the bedroom. There is no. Desk in the bedroom. There is no desk. There is no table. There is no book on the table. There is no pillow. There is no bed, etc., etc. La otra forma es there isn't. Si usamos isn't otra vez, necesitamos usar el artículo a. There isn't a. There isn't a table in the kitchen. Yes? Ustedes elijan ahí qué forma les conviene más utilizar, right? There's no or there isn't a. Igual en los plurals. There are no chairs in the living room. Aquí usaríamos there aren't any. Repeat, there aren't any chairs in the living room. There aren't any Quiero que nos enfoquemos en esas plurales. En la afirmativa decíamos there are some. La palabra ahí, some, porque es en afirmativo. ¿Ok? Negativo, there aren't. Cambiamos are por negativo. Aren't. There aren't. Y ya no vamos a usar some. Ah, vamos, vamos a usar ahora any. There aren't any. There aren't any chairs. There aren't any uh, bananas in the refrigerator. There aren't any eggs in the refrigerator. Okay, there aren't any. O oh, podemos usar there are no. Okay, let's continue. There are some chairs in the kitchen. There are no chairs in the living room. There aren't any chairs in the living room. There's equals there is. To better understand how to form this statement, I would like to write some formulas. For singular objects, there plus is or isn't plus a, that's the article a, or no, plus complement. For plural objects, there plus are or aren't plus some or any or no plus some kind of complement. Vaya, quiero que analicemos ahí. Ok, la primera fórmula dice there plus is. ¿Cuánto es afirmativa? There is. O oh, there plus isn't. ¿Cuánto es negativa? Ok. Luego necesitamos el artículo a. Ok. En el caso de las afirmativas y el complemento. Por ejemplo, uh, there is a problem. There is a problem. Ok. Or there isn't a problem. Or there is no problem. There is no problem. Ok. Vamos a hacer entonces como una pequeña dinámica con eso. Let me check. There are books. There are, there are a books, no, me es Juan, porque el A no lo vas a usar cuando es plural, ¿ok? El A no lo usarías ahí, ¿ok? Vamos a ver. So, one example affirmative and you change it into negative. Ok, let's start with uh, singular. My example is there is... There is a car. There is a car in the garage. There is a car in the garage. Can you transfer that into negative? There isn't a car in the garage. Correct. One option. There isn't a car in the garage. Repeat. There isn't a car in the garage. There isn't a car in the garage. Isn't a car. Or there's there, no there, car. There's no car in the garage. There's a car. No car. There is no car in the garage. There is no car in the garage. 
Ok, wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Vaya, viceversa ahora. Let's do the other way around. Voy a hacer un negativo y ustedes lo pasan a afirmativo. Listen. Ok, the example is negative. There isn't any apple. There, there isn't an apple. There, there is some apple. apple. Okay, there is there is an apple. There is an apple. There is an apple. Okay. Hagamos otra negativa. There is no there is no chair. There is no chair. chair. There is a chair. There is a chair. Okay. Another one. There isn't a bed. There isn't a bed. There is a bed. There is a bed. Excellent. 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 Again, I'll go with positive. There is a refrigerator. Transfer it to negative. There isn't there is a refrigerator. Correct. There isn't a refrigerator. All right. Let's go with plurals. Plurals. Uh oh. Plurals. In plurals, we use there are some. Okay. For affirmatives. For negatives, there are no. Or there aren't mm. any. Okay. Let me say a negative example. There are no computers. There, there are some computers. Some yes, computers. everybody, everybody. There are some computers. There are some um, computers. Repeat, 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 repeat. There are there some are computers. Hay algunas. There Ay, are algunas. some computers. Correct, yeah. correct. Next example in plural. There are no stoves. There yeah, are some, some stops. Correct. There are some stops. Okay, next. There are no chairs. There are some chairs. There are some chairs. Okay. There are no mirrors. There are there. Oh, there. There are 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 some mangoes. There are some mangoes. There aren't any mangoes. There are some avocados on the table. There aren't any avocados on the table. There aren't any avocados on the table. Avocados on the table. Okay. There are some eggs in the refrigerator. There are eggs in the refrigerator. In the refrigerator, porque in significa adentro. On significa encima, entonces tenemos que usar in. Okay, very good, very good. Do you have any question? Do you have any example? No? In Veronica's house, in Veronica's house, I see a refrigerator. There is a refrigerator in Veronica's in Veronica's house. ¿Ya lo vieron? You see that? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> there is a window behind uh, yes. Fernando Hernandez. There is a window in your house. Yes. Huh? 
There is a window. Okay, okay. Let me see. That's it. That's it. There is a lamp. <coughs> there is a lamp in uh, Nelson's apartment. I think you saw apartment. There is a lamp there, right? I see it. Aha! I have eagle eyes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Nice job, guys. There is a light switch in Daisy's house. There is a light switch. ¿Saben qué es un light switch? Toma corriente. Correcto. There is a light switch. Thank you so much. Nice job. Let's continue. Let me share my screen. Let me share. Or any or no plus some kind of compliment. So let's take a look at the first example on the left hand side of this chart. There's a bed in the bedroom. This is a singular object. So we're going to follow the formula there plus is or isn't plus a or no plus some kind of complement. So in this case we use there then the verb to be is is um, on the example is contracted as you can see there's we will use the article a the complement is bed in the bedroom we're going to do something similar with the next example there's no sofa in the bedroom at the beginning of our sentence we have there the verb to be is is once again on the example is contracted then we will use the article a because we are talking about a singular object. Finally, we have the complement. Sofa in the bedroom. The last example. There isn't a table in the kitchen. At the beginning of our sentence, we use there. The verb to be is isn't because we're expressing something negative. Then we use the article A because we're talking about a singular object. Finally, we have the complement, table in the kitchen. Now let's look at the right hand side of this chart. For these examples, we're going to talk about plural objects. So we need that formula, there plus are or aren't, plus some or any or no, plus some kind of complements. Now let's uh, look at the first example on the right hand side of the chart. There are some chairs in the kitchen. At the beginning of our sentence we use there. After that the verb to be are. Next we use some. It's important to mention that we will use some whenever we're making positive statements. We can't say any, for example. Finally, we have the complement, chairs. ¿Se entendió esa parte, guys? El some lo van a usar solo en afirmativas. ¿Ok? Any lo pueden usar en negativas y en preguntas. ¿Ok? In the kitchen. Our next example. There are no chairs in the living room. At the beginning of our sentence, we use there. After that, the verb to be are. Next, we're going to use no. Notice that we will use this expression whenever we're expressing something negative. And you can also say aren't any as well. Either one is correct. Uh, finally, we have the complement, chairs in the living room. For our uh, last example, there aren't any chairs in the living room. We start our sentence with there. Next, the verb to be aren't. After that, we're going to use any. It's important to remind you that we will use any whenever we are making negative statements. We can't say some, for example. Finally, we have the complement, chairs in the living room. 
Now it's your turn to practice. I would like for you to describe the objects that you have and don't have in your house or apartment. After you finish this task, please share your work in our discussion forums. All right. So where are you right now? Are you in your living room? Are you in your bedroom? Are you in the dining room? <laughs> where are you right now? And tell me something that you have and something that you don't have. For example, me, I'm in my office in my house, okay? There is a fan in front of me because uh, it's very hot here. So there is a fan. There is a fan for me, okay? Um, there isn't a refrigerator in this office. Do you understand? So you have to tell me something positive and something negative. Let's practice singular form first, okay? Singular, only singular. There is a for affirmative. There isn't a or there is no for negative. Examples, please. Examples. Give me examples. Go ahead. Participation. There is a fan behind of me. Okay. Negative. And there isn't a, a TV. Fantastic, Elena. Well done. Thank you for the participation. Next, please. I'm, I'm listening. Go ahead. Go ahead. Hello. There is a garage. There is a garage in your house. Yeah. That's an affirmative example. Well done, Kimberly. Can you tell me something that there isn't in your house? There is a TV in the living room. Oh, okay, Daisy. There is a TV in the living room. Okay, that's affirmative. Okay, thank you. Remember, I need one positive and one negative. There I'm is listening. a tray in the living room. I'm sorry, can you repeat? There is a chair in the living room. Okay, solo poner el artículo a, a chair. A chair. There isn't a chair. That's correct. That's correct. One more example. Let's go, guys. Let's go. Something positive, there... something negative. Go, Ana. There is a lamp. Okay. And um, there isn't a uh, fan. Perfect. There is a lamp, but there isn't a fan. I understand. I understand. Next. Participation. Next. Um, there is a windows in here. Okay. And the negative? There is no window in here. There's no window here. Okay, thank you, sir. Next. There is a pen in my hand. There is a pen in my hand. All right, there is a pen on my hand, correct? Yes. There is a pen, dice, there is a pen on my hand. Hay un lapicero sobre su mano. And, okay, now the negative example, please, Wendy. There is, there isn't a hand on my hand. There isn't a hand on your hand. Okay, there isn't a hand on your hand. No. All right. There is a pen on my hand. There is a, okay, there is a pen on your hand. Outstanding, thank you so much. Thank you, somebody else? Vaya, vamos a negativo. Vamos a, perdón, vamos a plural. Plural, plural. Affirmatives. ¿Qué tenemos alrededor de nosotros que es plural? Let me see. There are some jeans. Right? There are some jeans on the bed. There are some shoes under the bed. Uh 
Ajá. There are some pens on the table. Um, there are sender and munchers. Can you repeat? There are uh, there are several um are munchers. There are several. Okay, perfect. <clears throat> a big quantity, right? There is a big quantity. Thank you. There are some watermelons in the refrigerator. There are some choco bananas in the fridge. <laughs> there are there some, are some in the kitchen. flowers in the yard. There are some flowers in the yard. Yes. There are some chocolates for you. There are some candies in the piñata. Uh huh. Continue. There, there are, are some pictures in the living room. There are pictures. There are some. There are some pictures in the living room. Uh huh. Next. There are some book. books. Books. There are some books. Yes, there are some books. Hay algunos libros. All right. All right. Very there are, well. there are some color color pen in my office. Colors. Color y la pronunciación al, al principio para hablar de existencias. Hay. Esto es lo que hay de haber. There. Ojo. There. Se puede confundir con el subject they. No debemos de confundirlo. Okay. Este es there. Singular. There, there is. Plural. There are. Okay. There. 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 There, there eso. There. Okay. There, there aren't any candies. There my... aren't any candies. That's totally right. Good job. Good job. There aren't any candies. Negative. More negative. In plural. There are not many paintings. There are not many paintings. There aren't many paintings. It's correct. There aren't many paintings. Thank you, Fernando. Next okay. example, please. Participation time. No more? There are no things. There are no pencils. Pencil. There are Go. no pencils. Pencil. Muy bien. There are no pencils. There are no t-shirts. There are no caps. There are not many students. There are not many students. There are not many opportunities. Right? There are not many dollars. There are... <laughs> Uh -huh. There aren't any orange in the refrigerator. Oranges, plural. Orange. There yes. aren't orange. any oranges, oranges in the refrigerator. Oh, we need to go buy some oranges. We need to go buy some, porque es afirmativo, right? Ahí entra. Nice job, nice job. Okay, guys. Vamos a parar hasta acá, ¿verdad? Ya, ya es tardecito, pero... Vamos a ver qué hemos aprendido este día. Vamos a ver qué hemos aprendido este día. Joana Abigail Flores, ¿está usted por ahí? Present, teacher. Ajá, Joana, ¿qué hemos aprendido este día? Cuéntanos. Hello, Joana Abigail Flores, ¿está usted? Bueno, ok, um, let's go with Ana Gabriela Correa. Can you hear me, Ana Gabriela? Hello, teacher. Hi, Ana Gabriela. ¿Qué hemos aprendido este día en esta sesión? Ok, give me a second, please. Sure. Ok, singular uh, and plural uh, sentences. With the, there, there. 
there, ajá. There. Es como con la D, ¿verdad? There. there. Ajá. There. Ok. Uh, vocabulary. New vocabulary. New vocabulary. That's nice. Ok. <laughs> <laughs> only that, only that, no problem. Okay, let's go with Abigail Martinez. Hello, Abigail. Bueno, Rebecca Eunice Fernandez, how you doing? Can you hear me? No sé si están o no están, o no sé si soy yo. Vamos a ver, uh, Gladys. ¿Qué hemos aprendido este día, Gladys? Justiniano. Ay, que me cuesta decir eso, mis. Ay, Dios, a mí me cuesta el inglés. <risa> <risa> este, hemos aprend he aprendido el vocabulario, ¿verdad? También he aprendido cómo afirmar lo que hay en el bedroom, en... Eh, también en chicken, eh, cómo decirlo en plural y mm. también singular las cosas. El vocabulario de los muebles, el furniture, furniture vocabulary, estudienlo, repítanlo mucho, por favor. All right, thank you so much. Vamos a ver, Eric Martínez, ¿cómo te sientes, Eric? ¿Por qué casi no participas conmigo, Eric? ¿Qué está pasando ahí? Yo necesito ahí. Más poder masculino. No, solamente trata la manera de que cuando existe una duda, espera y espera, bueno, y al final siempre la responde y logra entenderla. ¿Verdad trato. que sí, con las repeticiones? Sí. Así es. ¿Cómo te sientes? Pues muy bien, gracias. ¿Estás aprendiendo? De a poco, pero ahí vamos. All right. Vamos con la plataforma, ¿verdad, chicos? Vamos a ver... Wendy Rivera de Escalante, ¿cómo se siente en este curso, Wendy? Cuéntenos. Pues la verdad me gusta mucho porque llevamos continuación con el libro también. Y da el chance para preguntar y todo eso. Ok, se siente bien. Y pues todos nos respetamos, ¿verdad? Todos estamos en, una, en un ambiente de, de muy, muy profesional, de mucho respeto y, y me gusta cómo trabajamos, todos respetamos el, el momento del compañero y pues cualquier duda, ustedes eh, tienen pues el poder de preguntar, ¿verdad? En esta hora sé que no es mucho tiempo, pero siempre tratamos de aprovecharla al máximo. All right. Right. Teacher. Yes. In the which and section should we go? Which section? Section number two. Right now, section number two. Esta semana tendríamos que terminar section number three. En teoría. Así que mañana le vamos a picar. Vamos a correr. All right? All right. Thank you for your attention. I'll see you tomorrow. Good night. See you tomorrow, teacher. Good night. Good night. Good night. Peace Good night. and love. Peace Good and night. love. Thank everyone. you, teacher. See you tomorrow. Goodbye, Good night, guys. Everybody. Goodbye. See you. Night, Bye. night. Bye. See you later. Goodbye, Y yo siempre los despido y no les paso la última asistencia. Oh my God. <laughs> Regáñenme, guys. Regáñenme. <laughs> oh my God. Ya se me desconectaron algunos, quizás. Vamos a ver. Avica y Noemí Martínez. No, ¿verdad? Vamos a ver. Abner y Tiel Cano. Avica y Noemí Martínez no les sirve el micrófono, dice. Gracias, mis muy amable. Azucena Perelice Bela Muñoz. Present. Thank you. Brian Edwin Flores Contreras. Present, teacher. Thank you. Eric Mauricio Martínez Cabrera. Helen Idalia Ramos de Escalante. Jessica Marielos Montes Gómez. Present teacher. Thank you. Joana Abigail Flores Díaz. Present teacher. Thank you. Juan Rafael Esquina Aguilar. Mm. 
y tenemos a Oscar Alberto Águila Romero. Present. Thank you. Sofía Elizabeth Pérez Ruiz. Qué pena, guys. I'm sorry. Siempre se me escapa esto último. I'll see you tomorrow. All right? 9 p.m. Night, night, everyone. Good night. Sweet yeah, dreams. Everyone. Good night. Elena. Okay, Good night. Elena. Ahorita la pongo. Good night, everyone. Bye-bye. Mm-hmm.